Alright, what's going on guys and gals? And we are back! And no, it's not a brew review this time. <laughs> what you were looking at here, it's called the APF TV Fun. And what it is, is a Pong console. So this would be like the days before Atari 2600 and, you know, shit like that. We got GMC here. Because, Old school. to demonstrate this, it's hard to play with myself, so... No, it's never good that to play was... it. It's never good to play with yourself while you're by yourself. Yeah, it also came with a gun. There's like a bunch of different variations of this. I was looking it up on eBay and stuff and on online. And these go for around 20 to 30 on eBay. If Something they're working. Like that, yeah. And what we got is a 1990s <laughs> Magnavox TV, which I wish it was a turn dial from the 70s, but hey, it'll work. So you have a 70s console... With a 90s TV hooked up to an 80s machine, too. Yeah, there's a Nintendo there, and then, of course, VCR from the 90s. This is basically like a pre-millennium setup I got going here. What's a VCR? Yeah, gee, I don't know. Tapes? What are tapes? But anyway, let's hook this bitch up and demonstrate it. We'll be right back. Alright, I'm sure you're wondering how the hell do we hook this up, so... We got the adapter right here, which your antenna goes in, and that that's old school right there. This two prong deal, the three hundred ohm. Yeah, buddy. But I got a little coax adapter for this, for this end. You're and right. then you got your switch between your game and your TV, as you can see right there, and your antenna goes in here. What's an antenna? I don't know. What and of an course, antenna? this is a cord coming from the console. So. Do you want me to... Yeah, yeah, uh, you, you do the camera manning. Or I do the camera the manning. All right, so... We'll go in back of the TV here. Here, let me... Oh, okay. We'll do some close-ups. So we just simply... Notice, no flat screen here. Yes, this is all tube. Okay, so we got that part of it. Tubage. And I'm going to need the power supply. Well, we'll hook up the cylinder, cylinder controls here. Cylinder controls, yes. It, yeah, and these are kind of some unique looking controls here. They kind of have like the knob, and this this is all you got. It's like an analog knob. Where's the button? Kind of looks like a corded dildo. Uh, I don't want to know about that. Anyway. We'll and no, these aren't here. analog controls, so. Yeah, your foot's on that. I'm sorry. I'm oh, falling over. We had a blooper. I'm falling over. <laughs> I'm falling over. I'm drunk, ladies and gentlemen. Someone's going to call us twats on this one, too. Probably. This one kind of has a piece that fell off, but I, I forgot to mention that this thing spent 30 years in the attic, and literally the day after it came out of the attic, it worked. Yes. I shit you not. I mean, this is how good a quality we got. You put a PlayStation up into an attic, and it probably wouldn't work. So, as you can see here, we got the wood grain. Ooh. This is fine oh. crap. 1970s wood it's crap. got the uh, brushed alum aluminum here around the knobs. And then yeah, here, you knobs. got... <laughs> and then you got your controls. I like the looks of the switches. Of course, you got tennis, hockey, handball, and pistol. Ooh. Reset. Ooh. Now. I'm playing with the knobs, sorry. I gotta yeah, okay. get the power supply. Hold on. Get the power supply. Up there. Well, this ain't the original power supply. I don't know where the hell it got to, so I'm just going to use this. You had to rig it up. Yes. Uh, and... Ha, <laughs> good one. Good after burp. Sorry. I keep forgetting. Every time we do videos now, I think we're drinking beer. Well, you kind of did. I'm not an alcoholic. There's the Nintendo Entertainment System. Also a yep. classic in modern era. Yes. Still works. Original. Yes, sir. Tetris. Tetris. Very good game. So now he has okay, the big, big old white wad of power. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. You gotta... Ah, oh, jeez. Have you noticed, ladies and gentlemen, that we never prepare this stuff beforehand? We just go with it. Or better yet, we'll just plug to the strip. Alright, yeah. So now we have... Okay, so we unplug the Nintendo and plug this what? in. Okay, what? the nerd even brought this up. Why do you need such a big thing like that? Why? What's wrong with this? What's wrong with a little cord like that attached to the box? Okay, so the TV is on. 
Channel 3, which... That's called static. Like, for people that don't know, that's static. Yeah, if you're watching this, like, in the future, ten years from now... And in the camera, you can actually see the lines going down. That's oh, and this is cool. a unique feature about this. See? You got your Channel 3 4 switch, which we have it on Channel 3, and... Batteries! Ooh. What kind of batteries do they use? C's. Yeah. I'm but you could see, it's a little corroded there, so I doubt it'll work. How many batteries would you need? Six. Six batteries. Yeah, I mean, the guy kind of explained this when he's like, why the fuck would you need batteries on a game console? Are you just going to play it at the beach? Well, it would probably not heat up batteries too much. But, turn it on. Maybe I forgot to set a switch here or something. Maybe. Did you forget? There, there we go. It is. Now, as you notice... It is in color. That's pretty high tech for 76. That is. Very but notice high the tech. static on your TV. Yes. Now, what's unique about this is that you got to the sound comes out of the console itself. Ah. So you got to turn your volume down on your TV. There is no volume on the console. So I'm winning so far. I yeah. I've scored 5 times so, and I haven't even moved the damn thing. Yeah, so there's like a little speaker in there. So Wait. All there right. I am. There I am. Hold on. This is the reason I brought her. We all need right, a all right. We need a Ashley, camera Ashley, take the cam. We're going to demonstrate this. We are currently playing tennis. All right. Oh, damn it. Wait, how the hell? We got to reset. Okay, reset redo. this damn thing. And no, uh... We don't need any, uh... Yes. Oh, that was oh it's nice getting shot. faster. Oh! <laughs> you fucker. Hey. Oh, uh, them fighting there. words. Ooh. Martina Navitalova shoots off. Oh! That was me. That was all me. I am so awesome. This is the very basic of graphics. It's dots and lines. And he's kicking my ass at it. Because I'm awesome. These dodo controls work pretty well. <laughs> Is that what you call them? The I call them dildos. The dodo controls. It's too bad they don't vibrate so like you, modern day controls. You can even hold controls. it on the side, too. It might make it a little easier. That is true. I mean, you can hold them whatever. Yeah, see, however the hell you want. Whoa, it's getting <laughs> fast. <laughs> Five zip. Oh, you got me on yeah. that. Yeah. My control seems a little fidgety, though. I don't know. I guess after you play it for a while and get all the dirt out of it, it's it's fine. But see, you can go down underneath the thing, too. Look at that. Okay, that's getting boring. <laughs> but see, you can even go out of bounds. Yeah, look. Oh! Oh! This is history right here, boys. Yes, it is. You thought Atari 2600 was history. <laughs> this is fucking history. So, GMC, tell me, is this the first time you ever actually played a Pong console? I've played Pong, but not a console. So, yeah, this is the first time I've ever played a Pong console. Bow! <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty much done. <laughs> oh, you're done? Actually, we got to demonstrate the other games here. Yeah, there are other games on here, so let me just kick your ass one more time, and then... Okay. Ah, oh, fucker. So what other games All right, we so we got hockey. It looks, looks the same. Uh, do you have to reset it or not? All right, let's reset. There we go. Yes, there we go. Yes, yeah, see, you got your... Yeah, see, it is different. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, this is different because you got a goalie there, too. Well, you control the goalie and the player, so. See, this is a little challenging here because yeah. you're not sure which one you are. See, I I didn't defend myself there. No, you didn't. See, GMC's a natural here at Pong. This is the first time he ever played it. See, when it's on your side, you have to, like that. Yeah, so I basically bumped it into your goal there. Okay, there I defended it. Welcome to Pong Hockey on 96.9 Web! <laughs> oh! This was uh, the Penguins and the Now, Bruins. it's too bad you can't break out, like, fights on here. I know. 
<laughs> I guess, uh... That's kind of hard to do with, like, a dot and... I can... Wait, wait, wait. I, I got an idea. This is how you do fights. <laughs> bam, bam, bam! You just punch the guy in front of you. There's your fights. Or punch the guy you're playing with. Ooh, that sounded bad. <laughs> that sounded horrible. <laughs> and kinky. I don't want to know about your kinky factor. You just keep that to yourself. Oh, shit. I'm just kicking your ass. What a... Alright, so we got handball. Well, now I have to reset it. This is actually a one-player deal here. Is it? Maybe not. No, it... Oh! All you can do is just beat the ball into the wall. Yeah, this is like... <laughs> this is like racquetball. Exactly, yep. It's like, I hit it, and then you have to hit it after me. Because, see, it went right through my trigger. You know what? I actually tried to play this alone. And you can do it, but it's hard to do. Mm. In other words, it's hard to play with yourself. It's very hard to play with yourself. <laughs> see, now, now that's yours. You, yeah, see? Yeah. There we go. Oh, that was a good one. That's oh! oh! See, once you get it going faster, it's kind of harder to hit it. This is simplicity at its finest right here, boys. Why'd it go through you? Because whenever I hit it, now it's going to go through me because it's your ball. Who? See? See, whoever hits it last, the next person gets it. See, now it'll go through me because it's your ball. Or your dot, as it were. Yeah, you were waiting for a joke there, weren't you? Yeah. Uh, we went through the town of Blue Ball while we were driving out. I know, I remember that. Yeah, Blue Ball. Just just saying! There was a intercourse ain't too far from there. Yeah. You're whooping my ass. Uh, Alright, the next game we got is Pistol. Now we're going to need the gun here. The gun. The gun. It looks real too, doesn't it? This, yeah. I would say this paved the way for the Nintendo Zapper back in the it day. It was, yeah, that was a Zapper so, gun. So, we plug this bitch in. All right. And switch it. Reset. reset. And basically, all you do is just shoot at the dot. This ain't like Duck Hunt. I hope the dot changes. See, I don't know how the accurate this is, though. You gotta stand back this far, like. And how did? You... Maybe you gotta. Maybe it's you gotta hand it off. I don't know. No, you don't use the cylinder controls. No, you don't. Huh. Uh, oh, sink. What about that one? Here, you want to try? Yeah, no, no. Oh, there we go. Yeah, but you're right up on the screen and did, still missed it. Ah! There we go. Yes. Okay. See, I just flipped that switch. <laughs> See, that's too easy. I'm not even pointing the damn thing. Yeah, he went to the ceiling. Nice. Watch, watch. Did it score? Yeah, it scored. All right, watch let's shoot dog. Ah, oh, dead. Kids, don't try that at home. No, don't try it at home. But anyway, this was our introduction to the APF TD Fun Pong Console. Yep. So <laughs> a little bit of retro tech here for you here at the whip. Just thought I'd share it with you. Super fun. Oh yeah, and this did belong to my, uh, this, this does belong to our deceased uncle, or it did. Yes, rest his soul, and thank you for keeping such a cool console in such good shape. Yeah, and as I said, they go for about 20 to 30 on eBay. I'm not selling it. I also forgot, to mention, I also forgot to mention these, uh, these, these controls are pretty much the same deal as these. Yeah, if you don't have those, that are, if you just want to yeah, if you, crowd around the other person. Yeah, can you imagine, like, crowding around and playing this? <laughs> but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vid, and uh, hey, we'll have more for you later. And stay tuned for a lot more brew of you, too, by the way. No doubt. Alright, we will see ya.